Since a few of you are interested in this, I thought I'd give you a little update. This is my um, LiDAR data to LightWave, uh, I don't know, plugin. It's going to be an app that exports an OBJ that you can open then in LightWave or whatever 3D program you want. And I'm curious as to what you guys might use this for. I've tried a few different techniques, different apps, to try to get the same kind of data out. And what I'm finding is that while the apps are really good at visualizing data, they're not so good at exporting it in a way that is usable uh, in a 3D app or in a game without a whole lot of extra work. And so what this app does is it takes the LiDAR data, it does a bunch of uh, smoothing, it does a bunch of uh, point reduction, and generates an OBJ file that you can you know, basically just uh, drop right into whatever 3D app you use. In this case, I've gone to opentopography.org and grabbed some data out of this, uh, exported a point cloud, imported that into the app, dumped out an OBJ, and it is slowly churning through that data and generating new parts of the OBJ uh, constantly. So that's what we're looking at right here. That's why there's a big hole here at the bottom. Um, anyway, it's working. Uh, you can see everything from the trees to this arroyo to the land masses and the ruins and everything, and you get height data that's accurate. Um, that's actually what I needed it for was the height data, and I'm going to be using this in a game. I'll cut off all the trees, of course, and add my own, but uh, it's kind of neat being able to actually get um, accurate height data because before I was using uh, the data from the uh, various things like Bing Maps and Google Maps uh, that the data was, I guess, satellite imagery, but it was very inaccurate compared to this. This is, God, this is fantastic. So if you need LiDAR data inside LightWave or in a game or 3D environment of some sort, please let me know what you might need and what you're using it for so I can kind of know what kinds of uses people might have for this. Thank you very much.